Now my phone doesn't recognize me. Ah! Catfish. Hey my babies, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is London Noel. I do videos Wednesdays and Sundays and I post content about lifestyle, beauty, um, fashion, a little bit of everything. So if you like that, go ahead and subscribe and press the notification bell so you're notified every single time I upload a video, which is, I think I said it, but Wednesdays and Sundays. Now, honey, this video is brought to you by Love Me Hair. Um, they sent me this gorgeous headband wig, y'all. Like, can you, can we talk about the movement? <laughs> can we talk about the body, the color? This hair is very pretty. Um, all the links to it will be down below, as well as my coupon code. They gave me 20% off for you guys, so go ahead and use it and get you a little headband wig, get you a little frontal, you know? Um, and yeah, let's just get into the video. I hope y'all enjoy. Bye. I did my edges and everything off camera. This is what they look like. Okay, on swim. I think I need to take my glasses off. Ooh, my naps on the back, honey. I ain't do nothing to those, but it's okay. Alright, so let's get into the wig. Um, so first off, what I see in here is a whole bunch of headbands. Y'all, this is probably the most headbands a company has ever sent me, like. These are, there's so many headbands. What? I thought I was going to get, like, two. Okay, so we have this camo one, um, a blue flower yellow one. We have this print, like a paisley print, cheetah, which I think I'm going to put on a cheetah today. And then we have, like, this yellow floral one so a lot of headbands to choose from so that's nice and then here's the wig um and we also have some more goodies in here so we have a wig cap which i already have one on so um and then we have this bag am i recording okay because i wasn't recording before and i was talking a whole lot oh they gave me tweezers okay period i need some tweezers um edge brush oh elastic band that's good i'm not sure what i'm gonna need it for but that's good they gave me bobby pins i love when companies give you scarves like i'm just because i'm always losing my scarf so i love when they give scarves so this is just a love me hair scarf and oh this is cute this is cute. This is a Love Me pen. So I'm, I'm gonna put it on the screen, but my promo code is Noel20 to get 20% off of your order if you purchase a headband wig. So, or any wig at that. Um, let's get into the good part, which is the wig. So it comes in this bag. This is the Mixed Color Highlights Bob Headband Wig. So, super pretty really cute um this is in the length 14 and then this is just what the color looks like we have one comb here two combs on the side one comb in the middle and then one comb on the bottom yeah this feels like it's going to be way more secure than my other one so so underneath my hair just so y'all know underneath i have braids and then i put it in a little bun at the back so it can stay out the way um yeah, let me just go ahead and put this wig on. I'm happy this has more than one comb in the front. Here's what she's looking like so far. This is not bad. I feel like. I 
Let me get my comb out so I can comb it. Ooh. I'm not terribly pissed. I thought this was going to be a little, I don't know. Like, I just thought it wasn't going to be it because it's colored. But I'm not, I'm not terribly mad. We're going to just go ahead and put on this cheetah one. Do I want to wear the cheetah? I mean, the cheetah is cute. Let me put the cheetah on. Or the camo. Should we do the camo? I don't know. Or should I just put on my own? <laughs> I'm low-key tempted to put on my own headband because I don't really... Let me just try it on. I'm going to just try it on. Let's see. y'all okay do we like the cheetah I, I i can't tell if i like the cheetah Ugh. okay so i couldn't find the head other headband i wanted to wear but it's not bad i was in the mirror for like 20 minutes and it's not terrible it's not bad like i'm not pissed so let me just go ahead and Kind of like, just make sure it's smooth. Run. y'all i'm not pissed all right so yeah i like it i don't know how the back looks <laughs> can't see back there but yeah it's cute okay it's cute so now i'm just gonna go ahead and do my makeup um i feel like i haven't filmed me doing my makeup in so long so i just wanted to put that in this video so i'm gonna go in with the milk hydro grip y'all know how i feel about this primer it's such a great primer it helps your makeup last all day non-greasy y'all know the tea on this primer so all right y'all so brows have been done off camera i'll show you guys what i use listen if you don't take anything from this video get this eyebrow pencil this is the archers and halos eyebrow pencil um in the shade i think espresso is it espresso yes an espresso so it's a micro defining brow pencil i get it from target it's really good the whole line is really good i have their brow pomade as well and then i also use the brow gel this is the clear brow gel from them too 10 out of 10 recommend um it's affordable it's creamy it glides on the eyebrows and look at look at them they look good like all right, I'm gonna go ahead and set my brows with Dharma Blend Translucent. Y'all know how I feel about this powder. 10 out of 10 recommend. I think I'm just gonna take a brown shade and put it in my crease just to give my crease some depth to it
okay i think that's cool um should i put a shimmer on my lid i haven't done like shimmers on the lid in so long let's swatch this color it was creamy oh should i put that on my lid i don't know if y'all can see that this is very pretty but like do i want to put a shimmer on my lid or do i just want to keep it not i think i'm gonna do a smoky eye <laughs> I don't know what I want to do, honestly. I'm just doing makeup. I haven't, I feel like I haven't done my makeup in so long. Like, I don't know. I think I'm gonna just pack that brown shade over all over the lid and let's just see where it takes us. I'm assuming that was a good idea. I think it was. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and do liner and lash. Y'all know I love the Wet n Wild Mega Liner. This is in the shade black. I always pick my liner up at five below because I think it's three dollars. Um, I'm not sure how much it is in like Target or Walmart, but it's three dollars and five below. Go get you some. I stock up on like three at a time because this liner is bomb. So I can't talk while I do this. So. <laughs> are watering i told y'all my eyes are so freaking sensitive <laughs> for no reason like why are you watering why now that the eyes are done very simple very natural natural um look as natural as i can get honey so on to my favorite part which is the complexion y'all know i love a good beat i love a good cake so i'm gonna go ahead and take the huda booty huda booty huda booty Huda, Huda Booty. <laughs> I'm going to take the Huda Beauty foundation. This is in the shade Nutmeg. And I'm just going to apply that all over the skin. Foundation on, so I'm going to go in with the Huda Beauty, the Overachiever Concealer in the shade Butter... Y'all hear that? But I'm going to take the Huda Beauty Overachiever Concealer in the shade Butterscotch. This is more so like my skin tone, um, just a little bit lighter. I just want to go in places like to cover up some bags, cover up my mustache. And yeah, that's pretty much it. No! Y'all. What the? <sighs> really? One thing I really love about this concealer in particular is A, the packaging, not the size of it because the size is so small, but like, I mean, the cool tip that's on it, it really, it feels really nice going under the eye. It's just so cooling and smooth and I think it like just erases my puffiness just a little bit or I would like to believe that it erases, erases my puffiness, but Anyways, let me go ahead and blend this out. Mm -hmm. 
And y'all would never believe that I have a mustache because what? Where is it? <laughs> Where is it? Obviously that concealer is a little red, um, but I just use it so that I can cancel out the darkness and the puffiness around certain areas of my face. So now I'm gonna go in with a brighter concealer. Okay, I might go in with a couple concealers, but y'all know this is my favorite, 10 out of 10 recommend. This is the Dior Forever Skin Correct Concealer in the shade 5N. did my makeup completely backwards I, I wasn't even thinking about it like concealer first I just did my makeup completely backwards that's okay Actually, I contour first but before doing concealer I don't know what just happened I don't know why I forgot that I'm using the hourglass vanish foundation in the shade espresso I believe this is the darkest shade and I think, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is the darkest shade and I feel like they definitely could have gone deeper, but you know, we'll work our way up there, but I'm gonna just contour with this. It's getting snatched. It's giving very much so snatched. We're already looking glowy and I haven't even added like highlighter, my blush or anything. Um, and I think that's because of the hourglass foundation stick it is a very creamy very glowy very smooth it glides on the skin um 10 out of 10 recommend Before I set my foundation and everything, I'm just going to go in with the Rare Beauty um, Cream Blush in the shade Happy. 
and I'm gonna just dab a little bit on my hand first because y'all know this product very much so pigmented. So I'm gonna just dab a little bit. Get my sponge. This get my sponge. Get my sponge. This is a real techniques um, beauty blender. Anyways, I'm gonna set with the Derma Blend loose blending powder, loose setting powder. Just tap a little bit and then tap off the excess. Y'all know how I do. And press. And you said how instant you see how instantly my under eye just looks nice and smooth like and I didn't even really use a lot of powder like I don't bake none of that I'm gonna go in with the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush bronzer in the shade Deep Fonts number four. I'm gonna go in with the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Instant Retouch Setting Powder in the shade Cashew and I'm just gonna set the sides of my nose and I'm gonna bake on the sides of my nose but I'm also gonna set under eye but I'm not gonna bake under my eye if that makes sense. I'm gonna bronze my face and I'm really excited <laughs> because I'm about to go overboard. I love a good bronze face. Like it just gives me a nice sun glow and especially during these winter time like months, like I need a nice sun glow. So I'm gonna go back in with the Charlotte Tilbury powder, the bronzer. And just I'm gonna set it first because I don't want my foundation to move underneath, so I'm gonna set and then I'm gonna swirl.
I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face. This is the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Not my chest is wet. Gee. I may have went overboard with the spray, but it's cool. Now it's time to glow. This is my favorite highlighter. Like, 10 out of 10 recommend. Would buy again. Actually have bought again, so I have a backup. But this is the Fenty Beauty How Many Carrots um, a Diamond Glow Bomb. Very pretty. Very sparkly. Very me. So... Just, just look. Do you see? Now, do you see why you guys need to go buy this? Because look. And it just gives my face such a glass-like finish to it. I mean, I was already glowy before, but this? Icing on the cake. Icing on the cake. Ten out of ten, recommend. It just looks so. My face just looks so glowy. Literally, just look like diamonds dancing on my skin. Like, get into it. Okay. Now on to lips. I'm about to fake my lip injections, which I will be getting one day. <laughs> but until then, I'm gonna fake it. and use my favorite lip liner ever um 10 out of 10 recommend this is the kkw beauty lip liner in nude 3 Do you see how easy that was for me to just glide on? I feel like this is one of the best lip pencil formulas I've ever used. Um, it's so creamy. It glides on like butter. Like it's just everything I would love in a lip pencil. And the color is perfect. Um, I know they have darker ones than this, I think. I'm not sure if this is the darker one. I think they have dark ones than this. So 10 out of 10 recommend. I love this lip liner. I'm not sure which kind of kind of lip I'm going for today. I have a few of my favorite products. <laughs> um, it's a lot, but I have a few of my favorite products, so I'm not sure. Do we want to go like a pinky nude today? I think we should do that. So this is the Patrick Ta. Um, she's unapologetic lip cream, and I think I'm just gonna. This formula is very different from what I have in my collection. Um, it's like a mix between a lip gloss and a lipstick. Like, 
it smooths on like a lip gloss but it dries down like a a lipstick it's a different formula which i really like i mean it's a cream so 10 out to recommend um put some right here yeah it's very comfortable on the lip though i really like these lip products um what do we want to do we want to lighten this up a bit i think we don't so i'm gonna go in with the patrick tosh she's expensive lip shine the major lip glow that's cute I'm just going to take a bit of the Too Faced lip injections and put that in the center of my lip just to give it a little more gloss but like a little more plump at the same time. So Period. That is how I fake my lip injections. It just looks so good and just so juicy. All right, y'all. So here is the final look with the makeup and the hair. Um, I think this turned out really cute. I was a little iffy about the hair color at first, but y'all, this hair turned out really cute. I love the length. Um, very soft. 10 out of 10 would recommend. So everything about this hair will be listed down below um, as well as my discount code so if you want to get 20% off go ahead and use noel20 to do that get you some money off get you some coins off honey um so yeah thank y'all so much for watching this video we are on the road to 1k hopefully by the time i upload this video we will be at 1k because we're, we're like here we're close um but yeah i really love this look i really love this hair to not to recommend um super quick and easy hairstyle with a super quick and easy makeup so if y'all liked any of these products go ahead and tell me down below let's chat in the comments and yeah i hope y'all have a great day um i'll see y'all in my next video bye